wait till you meet this kid, Joe. He's a fucking dynamo. Yeah, you've said. He's white hot. White fucking hot. He's gonna take this book, he's gonna shake it up, he's gonna turn up gold, I shit you and not. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. I'm anxious to meet him. You know what? If it wasn't against the good Lord's word, you know what I'd do to his writing? I'd put, put a, a ring, ring on it and, and be his lady, lady boy wife. wife. Yeah, you've, you've said. You've said. Fucking dynamo. Is he coming? It's 10 after. <gasps> Charlie! Good to see you, my friend. Please, take a seat. Charlie, this is Joe. He's my right-hand man. Tell Joe what you told me, what your plans are for the Green Lantern book. Tell you what I fucking tell you? The fuck am I looking at? Fucking dynamo! Sam, it's a fucking monkey! Whoa! Whoa, what the fuck? Racist! That ain't cool, Brosif Joseph! Sam, this isn't a racism issue. That is a fucking monkey in a shirt! I am, Charlie, I am so, so sorry. I do not know what has come over him. I have never ever seen him like this. I just want you to be rest assured this is not what DC Comics is about. You hearing this, Joe? He is dropping story bombs on us. He is laying out narrative magic. No, he's shitting in his hand. Dynamo! As Green Lantern's storyline Emerald Twilight became one of the most controversial in comics history, turning beloved Lantern Hal Jordan into supervillain Parallax and igniting a shitstorm amongst Lantern fandom. The writer responsible, his name was Ron and not Charlie by the way, but Charlie is a much better monkey joke figure it out, was threatened by fans at cons and became one of the first victims of the internet when the group Hal's Emerald Attack Team was formed with the aim of having Jordan reinstated as the one True Green Lantern. DC Comics would eventually retcon the Emerald Twilight storyline into oblivion. If you don't subscribe, we'll afflict this green tree frog with a mild to moderate inner ear infection. Doesn't seem all that awful, but it's probably better you subscribe, you know, because ear infections can get out of hand rather quickly.